Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and if you're new here, hi, I'm Layla. As you can see, I'm Briar, all Briar girls, and fun. Um, so today I'm going to be showing a quick DIY of how to make Briar jumps for your horses if you do not have jumps from Briar, which this is actually a great hack because I do not have jumps from Briar. S here, so... I just thought that would be cool. If it's not cool, whatever. I don't care. Um, so, yeah. That was from a Sonic Slush. Okay, so the first thing that you're going to need is two um, boxes or slime buckets. That's the same height. And what you need to do is just take those. First, you need to make sure that they're the same height. So these two are. So all you need to do is just spin them out between however you want and use some scotch tape or some whatever kind of tape you want and you just get a straw and set it across easy peasy next I'm just gonna set that okay that's not working So I'm not sure if it's gonna work, but there we go. So then all you need to do is just put it like that. Take some of your scotch tape, get two pieces of it, open it, and put some on one side of your straw. And put some on your other side of your straw. And there you go. You have your first briar jump. Depending on how many slime buckets you have and how many straws you are allowed to use, um, you can make a couple of different ones. So there's the first. Let me just scoot it down that way. Okay. So there's the first one. Hmm. I need to fix this one. I'm going to fix this one at the end of the video. Um, so now, you got a couple of more straws if you do. And all you need to do is take the tape and find two of the same kind of um, buckets and tape them. So now I'm going to use these two. I'm going to use... Why won't this one stay up? Oh, it's because all the slime is on this other side. I gotta fix that. Ah, do, 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 little bit of slime sash. Mm. Mm. There we go. Do, 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 do. Just fast. Close. Do, 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 do. Real fast close. Oh, no. Uh, sorry for the background noise. Sorry for all that background noise. That was my little sister who was not supposed to be in here. Oh my gosh. There's tape on this straw. I guess I tried to use this, use this straw the other day. <laughs> yeah, that's too far. I need to get this one on. There we go. Perfect. We're going to tape it again. Sorry if you can't see it very well. I'm having to prop up the phone um, while I tape it on there. So, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I'm just going to quickly tape that on there. There you go. There's our second briar jump. Okay. Um, I'm only going to show how to make two of them. Because I don't have that much time to make four more um, of these. So, yeah. If you have not checked out my updated Briar Barn Tour, please go and check that out. I didn't have these jumps set up then because I wasn't thinking about that when I was doing that updated Briar Barn Tour. So, yeah. If you want to go check that out, just go search Layla Pratt 
and check it out. If it shows up Taylor Pratt, that's because uh, it's the same person. Actually, it's not Kayla Pratt, actually. It's a different girl that they just call Kayla Pratt. So, yeah. So, at the end of this video, I'm going to fix this real fast. To fix it real fast. Let's say how to do it good fast. Good enough fast. Ugh, I'm gonna have to do this. Because I think it keeps going. There we go. All done. All fixed. There we go. So, there we go. As you can see, our fixed result jump. I'm not gonna pick it up like that ever again. It's not sticking very well, but that's fine, because um, I can just fix it again, so whatever, whatever, okay, there we go, so I hope you enjoyed this video, um, I hope you enjoyed um, this little tutorial um, on how to make a briar jumps with So before we go, quick dance party. I'm done. <laughs> Well, guys, um, that is all for this little tutorial. Goodbye.